Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So with the initial rollout and release of Windows 11 back in 2021, which was version 21H2, as many of you may know, Microsoft removed and deprecated a whole lot of the basic functions and some basic options that were previously available over on Windows 10. Now, in regards to features uh, that Microsoft did remove, um, new one has posted an interesting article um, um, lately where they have posted an article titled Top 10 Most Requested Features Microsoft Has Already Brought to Windows 11. And in case you're interested, uh, this is based on posts in Microsoft's Feedback Hub with the changes made, basically indicating a completed complaint, request, or suggestion, which now Microsoft has um, brought back or has introduced into the Windows 11 operating system. So um, if you are interested, just to dive straight in, as there's quite a lot to go through, and just to have a look at the top 10 most requested features that are now available according to the upvotes over on Microsoft's Feedback Hub. And this is by no means a, comp a comprehensive list, but just the top 10. Now, the first um, and with the most amount of upvotes, 11,100 plus upvotes, right-click the taskbar to open up the task manager. This um, is the most requested feature which now has been introduced back into the Windows 11 operating system. 11,100 plus upvotes as mentioned. And then um, number two with 10,500 plus upvotes, add tabs to the file explorer, which was a big one. And this rolled out in the moment one update um, last year in October for Windows 11. And although we have tabs, which does bring a lot more functionality, we still don't have the... Um, drag to open up a tab in a new window but nonetheless tabs in the file explorer are now available since the moment one update last year the second most requested feature then moving on to number three 8800 plus upvotes drag files onto apps on the taskbar and um, you can now drag a file onto an app um, on the taskbar and just to demonstrate i've just opened and created a text document pop that into my file explorer and i can as an example move that to my downloads and there we go available now dragging that um, and placing that onto apps on the onto the taskbar that's the third most requested feature that's now returned and then number four add folders to the start menu 7100 plus upvotes and this rolled out with the feature update last year in september for windows 11 version 22h2 so head into the start menu yeah i've created a folder already and if you click on that, you can edit the name. You can rename that folder. And just to demonstrate, um, you create a folder by just dragging an app uh, in the Start menu and placing that on top of a, another app. So um, add folders to the Start menu, the fourth most requested feature, now returned to the Windows 11 operating system. Moving on to number five, allow displaying the taskbar clock on all monitors. I'm just going to mention this. This has 6,100 plus upvotes. So... Um, that has been returned where you can now display the taskbar clock on all monitors connected to your device. And then moving on to number six, 5,800 plus upvotes, add dark mode support to Notepad. And, and that's quite a big one. Notepad now has dark mode support. And just a quick um, side note, tabs uh, for the um, Notepad rolled out in the Moment 2 update last week. But um, dark mode support... Um, for notepad number six and if we just head to the settings over and above adding dark mode support you can also change that to light dark and also use your system settings so there's a couple of options available there and then moving on to number seven and i'm just going to mention this one um, once again allow pairing bluetooth devices from quick settings menu this rolled out um, with uh, the feature update the windows 11 2022 feature update last year starting in September 4100 plus upvotes pairing Bluetooth devices from the quick settings menu now available in Windows 11 and three more to go number eight um, add dark mode support to task manager and once again we return to the task manager and dark mode support as many of you will know now available in Windows 11 and over and above that another requested feature which rolled out last week in moment two was the new search for Windows 11 version 22H2, which lets you search through your um, process IDs, your tasks, and so on in the task manager. But 
add dark mode support to task manager 4000 plus upvotes now available in windows 11 and then the last two believe it or not number nine a better pc health check app 3300 plus upvotes and i'm just going to mention this because i have posted um, numerous videos on the pc health check app so if you want to do a search to get more info on the channel and um, those videos will be available and basically the pc health check app uh, is used for checking if your computer can run windows 11 and um, now displays the exact requirements if it does not meet uh, those re system requirements like tpm2 or secure boot so that's number nine with 3300 plus upvotes and then number 10 the 10th most requested feature that is now available once again in windows 11 allow pinning apps to the taskbar by dragging them 2700 plus upvotes and this rolled out with the windows 11 version 22 h2 update feature update last year uh, starting in september now just take note this only works with the all apps list not from the actual start menu so you have to go to the all apps list in the start menu and as an example if i want to drag my calculator you can see i'm able to link and pin that uh, to my taskbar but it won't work as an example if you try to drag a pinned app from your start menu you can see that won't allow that so um allow pinning apps to the taskbar by dragging them 2700 plus upvotes are uh, the 10th most requested feature now available in windows 11 so that's just a quick overview of that article by neowin which by the way i'll leave a link to uh, in the description uh, the top 10 most requested features microsoft has already brought to windows 11 so thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one